Henry. Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. You love your face rubbed. This one's a little shy still, but she's getting better. All right, guys, we are out here in the horse barn. Um, this horse right here is a rescue horse. Kind of just borrowed her. Um, that way, because a little while ago, we only had that horse. So we needed a, a, a companion. So she just didn't be alone. And this is Henry, our race horse that we, the first horse that we, uh, we had born here on the farm. And he's just laid up for now, giving him a break from racing. Uh, he's just gotten super tall. He's huge. But he's friendly. And then obviously the little baby. And her mama. Like I said, I'm going to call her Scooter until they give her a different name. So we also have two more animals that are coming here today on the farm. And they're going to be brand new animals. Never had them here before. And they're going to be 4-H projects for my two girls. So later today, they should be here. When they're here, I'll film it and uh, see uh, how they do. Because we've never had these animals before. And hopefully we uh, are okay with them. Now, my brother-in-law, he, he raises them. So he's going to help us out with them. But uh, for now, we're going to run up to the pig barn. Get them guys all fed. And today I finally finished up the gates. We have to paint them today, so we're going to take care of that today. A few other things we are going to get into, but it's going to be a busy day. Now, I'm back working six days a week, so Sunday's kind of the only day I can really get stuff done around here on the farm. So, But let's head up to the pig barn and see how those bozos are doing, and we'll get on with our day. I'm gonna get these guys fed before they start squalling because they make a lot of noise when they're hungry. Put it on the list. Wait, what? 
Scooter. Big Scooter. Getting there, it's hard to paint all these little tiny half inch rods on these gates and get everything. But I think we're doing all right. We got that long one right there, and then there's one more in the garage with a gate to paint. But they're all prepped up and ready to go. But the kids went and uh, went to go get Subway, so I guess they're on a break. not thrilled about these hinges right here because you can't take them apart so I'm gonna have to figure out how I'm gonna carry this one up to the pig barn so but it should be okay we'll get it up there but hopefully the Sun stays up we can finish up these painting these guys and take them up to the pig barn I don't know if I'll get them assembled on this video but I'm sure gonna try because I need to get those guys separated but yeah, we let the baby out for the first time. She did pretty good. And uh, hopefully she gets acclimated. But we're still waiting on those two extra animals. So as soon as they get here, I'll show them to you.
nothing but a huge mud hole. It's going to take at least a week to dry all this up. Need to get some slag or crushed limestone put in front of the barn here. Make that a little better. But everything else, I want to turn this all into like a turnaround anyhow. Because it's, it's always laying wet. I'm anxious to uh, get this 1066 out in the field, see what I can do. I gotta go through it, probably change oil and all that good stuff yet, but excited to see what happens. Hey Baxter, what's going on puppy? I probably shouldn't be out here. It's gonna get all muddy. Let's get another bath. Yeah. No, I'll get out of the manure. Nope. Come on. Baxter, let's go, come on. We got weeds, let's go. to hit it but Julia. Yeah, you gotta push him. <laughs> yeah, like Isaac's doing. I'm a professional. <laughs> okay, it should be, it should be fine, Isaac. Oh, <laughs> say I play dead, bro. <laughs> yeah. Come on, get up, bro. <laughs> I think the camera's on. <laughs> Welcome in the. <laughs> Come on, Shotty. Come on. Oh my God, Olivia. Should be Shotty, and then. What's up, Shotty? Come on, shoddy. we can go inside yeah. if you stand up. <laughs> Let's go inside. He's gonna lay down the mud. Yeah, watch him lay down the mud. No, they don't like mud. Mud walk are pretty good, not gonna lie. <laughs> come, on, come on, uphill. Uphill.
All right, well, we got full houses down here and, and up at the pig barn. I did get the pens built and they're all separated. I'll take you guys up there and just make a whole video up in the pig barn. But yeah, so we got lambs this year and lambs I know nothing about. So hopefully it goes okay, okay this year with them. What do you guys need? Ducks want to come back in the barn. But anyways, guys, um, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. So I know there's a lot on here, but, you know, I'm going to film as much as I can with these lambs. And um, we'll see how it goes. Like I said, it's all new to us. So we don't really know much about them. But it's, it's going to be an experience. I mean, that's what 4-H is for the kids to uh, experience different things and just uh, work through the situations. So, all right, guys, if you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. And if you like seeing these videos um, and uh, you're not subscribed, please think about subscribing. We do videos like this all the time. And welcome any of the new subscribers that we've gotten over the last month or so. And I'll catch you guys on the next one.